Malcolm Todd, Art House, Guitar Tabs and Guitar Lesson. So a standard tuning here, EAD, GBE, and we'll kick it off with these intro kind of first verse chords here. And a lot of jazzy stuff going on here, um, interesting shapes. So we'll start with uh, C minor 9. So we'll do that here at the 8 on the E, 10A, and then we bar the 8s on the DGB, and then we'll have a 10 on the high E. And the first run through, this is probably like the first three run throughs, uh, we drop down to this F7, so just a basic bar chord shape with the 8 on the A, 10, D, 8, G, 10, B, 8, high E. All right, and then we move over to this G7 sus. So basically take that shape we have here, bump it up two frets, and you can just lift that B string off. So now we just have... Uh, 10 on the A, 12 D, 10 on the G, B, and E. All right, and then we do this little B string walk up where we'll take that 10 on the B that we have there, go 11 to 13. All right, and then we basically cycle it over and we would do that progression a handful of times, but then we kind of mix in this one little hitch where, you know, about every fourth time or so we do the same C minor 9 at the beginning, the 8 with the 10s. But instead of going to F7, now we do this D7. And uh, a nice easy way we could get that here, because we want this high, these high notes involved. But we can get that little bass note in there by just lifting off for the open D. And then we do a 14G, 13B, 14E. All right, and then just back to our typical G7 sus2 at the 10s with the 12 there. A little B walk up. All right. And we would go through that a couple times, two, three times, that whole thing. And eventually we get to where like the drums and everything comes in. And uh, this may very well be two guitars over the top of each other, but I think we can make it pretty well work well, you know, just combining them. Um, it, it almost kind of just starts where the last chord left off, the G7 sus2. So we start with that, the uh, 10 with that 12s. Okay, that one. And then we do this kind of bluesy, like, uh, scaling around in it. So uh, we would take that same shape there, hammer, um, basically an 11B, all right, and then a 10 to 12G, keep that, and then make a 12 on the D. Okay, so it's almost like a G minor seven look that we're going to here from that G seven sus two. So we went. Okay, and then just lift the 12 G back off to 10, keep that 12 D and 11 B. Okay. All right, and now we're gonna hammer tens on the D and G, and then we hammer the 10. Uh, 10D to 12. Okay, a little transitional thing. And then we move to our C kind of minor shape here, where we have our 8E, 10A, and then just 8s on the DGB. But uh, we hammer that 10D, or sorry, that 8D to 10, and then just come back off to 8, and then hit that 10A. Okay, so we went. All right, and uh, this next chord, we kind of alternate every other time. Uh, the first time through, it's this uh, F vibe, where uh, almost kind of like a F minor seven look or a F seven look, where uh, we just come on up initially and you just want 13s on the E, A, D, a 14, G, 13 on the B and E. And with this, we strum it. And then we kind of walk up the A string where we go 13 to 15. Okay, so the first run through. Alternating run through, 
uh, everything stays the same except for, except for the last chord where instead of coming up to the F, those 13s and all that, uh, we come up to basically like a big uh, D7 where we're going to bar 10s on the uh, everything here and then we got the uh, 12 on the A, get that 11 G and initially we want a 13 on the high E. Okay, and we're going to walk down that 13 high E, hit it once more, and then just lift off to 10. Okay, so that run through. Thanks for checking out the video, everybody. Like it, share it, leave a comment. It's always good to hear from you. Um, do me a favor and hit the subscription button. I put out a video pretty frequent, so you don't want to miss out on that. Uh, check out the links in the description box below. I have really cool links for uh, tablature books, all the gear I use, t-shirts, fun stuff like that. So thank you very much, and we'll see you next time.